Hey, this is Mike. Just want to show you this 2014 Dodge Dart in white. Now this one has the Rally Appearance Package. So let's go ahead and check it out. I really like the way it's white and it has the black wheels and the black accents around. It has the projector headlights as well as fog lights. four-wheel disc brakes now I believe that the the wheels on this are painted aluminum and they do have a, a gloss to them I guess you can say a slight gloss to the wheels it has a 2.4 liter multi-air engine Tiger Shark use the key here to open up the trunk Pretty decent amount of space it does uh, have the folding seats so you can add more cargo space if one needed under here the uh, you do have a tire inflating kit because it does not come with a spare tire something to consider now a spare tire is an option but it does not come standard you see right here this is the lens for the backup camera I like the way they have the dual exhaust on the four cylinder, that's pretty cool. Go ahead and open the door. Here's the inside of the back door. You got a bottle holder there as well as a little pocket. Window control, door lock control. Here's the inside of the back seats. Now they're accented with like these little stripes. This kind of gives it a sporty look as well as the stitching here. Armrest comes down and it has like a little storage compartment. Cup holders, a little place to get back access to trunk. You got a little pocket there. A little bit limited on storage, I mean, uh, leg room in the back when the front seats are all the way back, which they are. So it's a little bit limited there. You can fold the seats down with this strap here. You can see that the space behind the seats is not quite as big as the trunk, but it does give you the ability to um, add space if you need it. Here's the inside of the driver's door. You got a bottle holder, storage pockets here and here. There's a place to open up your gas cap, window controls, door lock controls and your side mirror adjustments and we do have manual adjustments here on the driver's seat as well as the passenger automatic headlights nice sporty looking steering wheel here leather wrapped okay let me leave the door open for a second so i'm gonna go ahead and start it up we should be able to hear the difference here between the outside and inside noise. All right. Okay. Here is my, here's the steering wheel turn the volume down and the fan down here sorry about the phone ringing happens sometimes but um, let me turn the ringer off just in case okay so the, the leather wrap steering wheel it does have the sporty look to it and feel to it it has pretty good thickness cruise control buttons are on the right side you have volume buttons on the back of the steering wheel back here so I can turn the volume up and down I can change the stations on the back of the steering wheel on this side. So I'm going to turn the volume down. On this side you have some up and down arrows and that corresponds with this little menu right here in the middle of the gauges. 
and right above that is your voice recognition button as well as your uh, Bluetooth phone so you can answer your phone by pushing that button there windshield wiper controls are there gauges are have like a red have like a red outline here as well as red accented gauges which is pretty cool this one does have the 8.4 Uconnect you have some stitching there on the dash I don't know if you can see it with the, the way the camera is but it looks pretty cool overall this this whole command center is pretty neat but it does have the big touch screen here with satellite radio it does come with one year satellite radio free with a new car you do have an auxiliary auxiliary input on this vehicle which I'll show you that in a second you have different controls this is your climate controls there's where your phone will be and you can have different set it up the way you want it now some of these let me check this one here's the window sticker I'm looking because because some of them I don't see it right off the bat but some of them are nav ready to where you can upgrade upgrade and have navigation this one doesn't appear to have it but that's something to look for when you're buying a new vehicle you can look and see if it's nav ready and that way you pay for a software up, up, upgrade and you have navigation on your vehicle but it has to be nav ready just to give you an idea of what everything looks like now I'm going to go ahead and put it in reverse so you can see the backup camera now the backup camera is is a pretty much these two lines right here give you an estimated trajectory of the vehicle some of them depend on your package if you turn the steering wheel it will adjust those lines but this one it does not do that and you have a, a slight wide angle lens on the camera so you can see where everything's a little bit rounded just to give you a broad view of what's directly behind the vehicle and the shifter I can go ahead and put it down and drive and then when I slide it this way that's where your auto stick feature comes in you can change gears auto, uh, manually but when you put it in the drive like that it's just regular automatic transmission now you do have some uh, buttons down here they're kind of redundant uh, extra buttons from the screen and on the steering wheel but they are um, not without use I mean they are good to have climate control and stuff like that there's your power supply there's a little storage pocket and that's what the shifter looks like cup holders are there and your emergency brake is there here's your center console this lifts up inside here you have your CD player which is now an option and your USB port power supply and auxiliary input is all inside this glove compartment is here pretty good size goes all the way back in there you do have an auto dim rear view mirror the speaker for your Bluetooth system when you're talking on the phone I think the the microphone I mean are up here on top of there there's your place to put your sunglasses and it's rubberized instead of foam you have tap lights up here visors have light, lights and mirrors same thing on that side all right let's look under the hood Oh, there it is. All right, there, 2.4 liter Tiger Shark. Get a little engine, get on gas. 
Battery's insulated, make it last longer. All right, there you have it, 2014 Dodge Dart Rally Appearance Package. If you have any questions, my phone number and email address will be in the description. See you next time.